Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming an exciting swatch party video on a palette I had no intention of buying. And then I saw it online and I was like, oh my gosh, it's available on Sephora? Let me buy it, why not? And this is what it looks like. I haven't bought a Tarte eyeshadow palette. When was the last time I bought one? I'm thinking it was the Heat one, what was that? Not Heat, but it was the one that looked like the Naked Heat. The Tarte. I'll put up a picture, I can't remember, it was like the beautiful tortoise shell, shell color thing. But this is so cute, you guys, look at it! It's the High Tides and Good Vibes palette, and this is made in the USA and has a 12 month shelf life. It's so cute because it has this beautiful little sea turtle, and there's some kind of cool liquid in here that moves around when you move the palette around, and it reminds me of that little game that I used to play that have the little bubbles in it in the water and you squirt, squirt the rings onto the different goal posts. Do you guys remember that? Anybody else? No? Okay, just me. And then on the inside, there's a little hashtag see the change. So a fun fact about me, I used to want to be a marine biologist as a child. Obviously, I lived on an island. Like, that seems like not so much of a stretch. So when I saw the little turtle, I was like, oh, maybe this will like educate people on like saving sea turtles and stuff. But Gorgeous palette. This is what the inside looks like. We have some neutral shades, some fun pops of color, and some pressed glitters here in the middle. So let's stop blabbing and let's start swatching. I don't know what to expect. <laughs> Ooh, that was very creamy. Okay, these are the first three shades. We've got Buried Gold, Aloha Beaches, and Beach Therapy. And they all smell like cocoa, which is so nice. Ooh, the matte's actually pretty pigmented which is quite shocking. And then there is a brown shimmer here called Galapagos. I mean, the neutrals definitely are very standard Tarte shades, <laughs> but the formula definitely feels like it's done some improving. So I'm definitely excited to wear this palette on my eyes. And then let me swatch the more fun colors, I guess I would call these. I mean, for Tarte, at least, you know? <laughs> so there's the other four shades. Wow. Okay, the mint color, the mint matte, is a little bit, eh, you know, but we'll see. So those shades are called Dive In, which is the shimmery dark blue. We have Surf's Up, which is the mint. South Beach is the pink. And then the other shimmer is called Deep Blue. South Beach looks like it would be a beautiful blush color, even just looking at it in the pan here. So, not bad, Tarte. Let's try swatching the pressed glitters. Here they are. Oh yeah, these, <laughs> these are gorgeous though. Look at them on my fingers. So, I mean, these don't look like anything too spectacular. I mean, they're beautiful, the colors are beautiful, and I think these would be gorgeous with the glitter glue, but are they like, Super unique as far as being like a duochrome or anything like that, not so much. Oh, I could do this all day. I could just sit here and wave my finger fingers around at you guys. So here it is. I am excited to do an eye look with this palette and see how it turns out. Definitely feels like the formula is a little bit better, at least on these, the actual eyeshadows themselves. These two mattes do look a little light, but I'm not gonna judge yet. I'm gonna try it out and keep you guys posted on the situation. I also just wanted to point out, I had talked about these glitter palettes in a different video, um, but look, some of these shades look very similar to the glitters in the Tarte palette. So if you guys are not wanting to spend like 40 bucks on a Tarte palette, you could try and look for this one. This is the Pixi Blue Pearl Glittery Eye Quad. I found this at Target. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little swatch party video. Leave me a comment down below with your thoughts on Tarte. Do they deserve another chance? Are you guys still on the boycott Tarte train? I'm so curious to know. And so leave me comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!